Simple Present Tense Let's understand the word order of Simple Present Tense. The sentence begins with the subject, which is followed by present form of the verb and which is followed by an object. So your word order is subject plus present form of the verb plus the object. Let's understand it with an example. Example 1. I write a letter in English. This is your sentence. Which is the subject here? I. Write is the present form of the verb. A letter is the object. In English can be the rest of the sentence. This is the sentence given to you which is in the simple present tense. Now how to identify the object? It is very simple. If you ask the question beginning with what, then whatever answer you get is the object. So, in the above sentence, if you ask, what do I write? What is the answer that you get is a letter. So, a letter is the object. You need to understand this formula to change an active voice verb into the passive voice. It's very simple. The sentence in the passive voice always begins with the object. The object is followed by to be form of the present tense. It is followed by the verb past participle. Please remember children, the passive sentences always contain the past participle of the verb. It is followed by by, then the subject, and then the rest of the sentence. Let's apply the formula to this above given sentence. Object. Which is the object here? A letter. To be form of the verb is past participle of the verb written by, then the objective case of the subject is me and rest of the sentences in English. So your answer is, a letter is written by me in English. Let's take one more example to understand it better. She sings songs in the party. Well, first identify the object by asking the question, what does she sing? Songs. So, songs is the object. So the passive voice sentence begins with songs to be form of the verb of present tense, are. Past participle of the verb sing is sung by her. Her is the objective case of the subject she and then the rest of the sentence in the party. So the answer is songs are sung by her in the party. Now see one more interesting example. They face many problems. What do they face? Many problems. So your object is many problems. Your sentence begins with many problems. To be form of the verb are because problems is plural. We have to have plural form of the verb are. Past participle of the verb face faced by them. They is the subject, them is the objective case of the subject. So your answer is, many problems are faced by them. Let's take another example. They choose the site. What is the object? What do they choose? The site. So the site is the object. It is followed by to be form of the verb is past participle of the verb choose is chosen by them. They is the subject, so the objective case of they is them. So your answer is the site is chosen by them. Here is one more example for you. The shells give out a fearful sound. What do the shells give out? A fearful sound. So, a fearful sound is the object to be form of the verb is past participle given 
So your answer goes something like this. A fearful sound is given out by the shells. Isn't it interesting, children? Subscribe to my channel. Click on bell icon to get notification about new videos.